Dear future Abby, I am so eager and excited to meet you. I have been thinking about you nearly every day of this year because of how badly I want to meet you. I'm writing this letter to you during the coronavirus global pandemic and the 2020 US election where Donald Trump is campaigning for his second term. I don't know which is scarier, but I need something to keep hopeful. And the only thing that really has is the idea of you, future me, future Abigail Pedazzo. It astonishes me how different I was during the 2016 election year and how little I knew of what I was capable of. Thinking of the difference between who I am now versus then makes me question what other possibilities there are. So many questions clutter my mind. Do I have my own space where you are now? How about kids? How about a lover or two? How is my family? Do you still love traveling? How the heck do you make a living? And is it fulfilling? How is Sunday Jump doing? Where do I live? Historic Filipino town? Is it an apartment in the city? I'm hoping so. What color is your hair? What's your morning routine? What's your night routine? Do you still take vitamins? Did you ever stop procrastinating because who I am today would really love to know how? Do mom and dad know how much I love them? Does my family see me get my, get a degree? How are my siblings? Who got the Rosewood Japanese Entertainment Center? What about my tito, tita, Jack and Jackie and Lola in Australia? How are they? Do you go back to see them? What about all of my family in the Philippines? Will we get the chance to reconnect? Will my older sister have her own coffee shop by Marcos Highway for morning commuters and dedicated students? Will our house be built by then? Do I get a ro room that overlooks Baguio where I can watch the sunrise, sunset, and moon? The only reason why I ask is because these questions keep me determined, motivated, and hopeful that one day I will know the answer, the answers that you have, the answers that I'll be able to experience if who I am now works for it because every day that passes is a day I get to discover who you are. So until then, the present Abigail Pedazzo trying to figure this shit out. 